Welcome back guys. Today is a review on a custom minifigure that I painted. Um, it is a no class arc trooper and I made a one custom weapon. I made the ammo belt right there. I made a pauldron and I made a comma down there, but you can't see that quite yet. Okay, let's uh, look at a pauldron here. So this is the pauldron. I made it out of paper towel. You take the paper towel, paint it black, it becomes very stiff. Paint it black or white or any color really. It'll become very stiff. Take a hole puncher, punch a hole, and then cut out the remainder, and then paint it. So that's how I made the pauldron. Onto the helmet. Here we have a little symbol. I don't really know what it is, but it's a little symbol. And I really like the outlines around the visor. Uh, those were used, all of the paint detailing on here was used with toothpicks. Toothpicks are very good for um, painting Lego figures because they're very precise and they get the job done pretty well. Um, if you're more skilled with a paintbrush, go ahead, but I prefer to use a toothpick. Okay, and here we have... So that's the head, just a standard angry clone head that we've had for a few years. Push that in, and then you can see that I gave him... I want to focus in. Um, stupid motorcycles. So right there we have his um, identification number. It's not an actual number in Star Wars. It's not Argosh. But I just did it because the ammo belt right here, that does not come off. Um, so it doesn't come off. I use tacky glue to glue it on to the body. Again, I used a toothpick to color the body. And this arm right there, that is just a Lego red arm. The other arm I painted right there. And it also has that elbow. It has that elbow paint right there too. Onto the leg paint, um, yeah, I just painted a simple knee pad with a uh, red stripe down the center. These blaster, uh, this is a Clone Army Customs, I believe, DC-15A. I painted a little blue dot on the end. And this right here. This is a custom blaster pistol. It looks a lot like the one they use in the original Clone Wars. Uh, the 2002, I believe, Clone Wars. Um, it's a standard rifle with the attachment joint cut off the back, scope off, and the barrel cut down a bit. And it does have a blue dot as well. Now we have to see the comma. Yeah, this is the um, pauldron. That's the pauldron right there. That nice design on it. This is the comma. So it wraps around the side. It's the same technique as the pauldron. And I just used some tacky glue to glue it on. I want to make ones with uh, leg holes, I might, yeah, this figure was a commission from one of my friends, um, it's not on sale on eBay, so my others will be once I get a bit more talented, um, yeah, check back for more Lego videos, gaming videos, Pokemon videos, pretty much anything, and 
I have um, have a little Harry Potter, Voldemort and Cedric here. So I want to recreate the scene where Cedric dies because it's a, I like that scene. It's a pretty good scene. Um, yeah, we'll probably be doing that soon. And goodbye. <laughs>